Hey, it's Sam. And Kirsty. Okay. <laughs> Here from the breakfast show on from seven till eleven every weekday morning on Pooh Gets Live eighty nine point five. Doesn't Scott say man? Hey guys, it's Sam and Kirsty. We're here from uh, Pooh Gets Live eighty nine point five, the breakfast show. Hi, <laughs> I'm. Ki oh no, you start. Hey, it's Sam and Kirsty. We're here from Pooh Gets Live eighty nine point five, the Go breakfast show. Sorry, can yeah. I start again because I wasn't. I was just going. <laughs> I'm done on the camera. Start, start again. again. <laughs> Normally our hair is sort of more like this. Thanks, Sam. Thank you. Catch you in the mornings, guys. Breakfast with Sam and Kirsty, weekdays 7 to 11 a.m. on Phuket's Live 89.5. You're watching Phuket News TV and a very important green initiative coming up very soon on the island and to have a talk about that we've got Nick Anthony from the Going Green program on Live 89.5. Nick, what's happening next week? Hi, uh, hi Tim. On the 20th to the 22nd of September, so that's a Friday through the Sunday, there's a three-day clean-up campaign around all of Phuket. This is part of an initiative started in Australia with the Clean Up Australia campaign, which is broadened into something called Clean Up the World. Uh, we've been very fortunate to work with a lady called Kunying Chodjoy Sopan Panich, who is from Bangkok and the founder of Magic Eyes campaign. And uh, we've been working with her to introduce a litter campaign here on Phuket. And so this three-day event is going to effectively launch that campaign. And uh, we'll be doing all beaches, mostly on the Friday, uh, with uh, two beaches on Saturday, Qatar at 11 a.m. on Saturday. Okay, so Qatar Beach, 11, 11 on Saturday. 11 a.m. on Saturday. Yep. That's the 21st. Yep. Uh, Karan Beach at uh, 4 p.m. on Saturday. That's on the 21st. And nearly all other beaches on the Friday. And uh, you can get those dates and details uh, from the Phuket News website. There, there's no doubt that cleaning up the beaches here in Phuket makes an enormous difference to the look and the, the feel of the island. And whose responsibility it is is something we could talk about forever. But the fact that we're getting behind moves like this, they're usually great fun days. If people come along, what, what can they expect? They'll be given some gloves and a bag. Well, I'll, I'll highlight uh, one event on a Saturday morning. Uh, which is going to be at Kata Beach. Starting at uh, 10 a.m., there's going to be a clean up the beach boot camp with uh, Crick's uh, Luther, which is a lot of fun. So you can go down to the beach, do an exercise program for an hour, and then there's a beach clean from 11 till 12. So that's a nice, nice thing to do. So that's, a, and, you know, that's, that's going to be fun. So every beach on the island covered? Every beach, uh, starting off at Maikau, all the way through to Rawai and uh, around to Cholong. The dates once again? 20th September to the 22nd. And you can go to thepuketnews.com and get some more details. Nick, thank you very much for your ongoing commitment and your passion, and uh, we're always happy to get involved, and uh, we'll see you down there on uh, the 20th to the 22nd. That's it. Keep the beaches clean, and uh, indeed you can do it at home, around your community, or anywhere on the island. Nick Anthony from the Going Green program on Phuket's Live 89.5. Thanks for joining us. Great, thank you. That's Tim Newton here reporting for Phuket News TV.